everyone, and thank you for joining me today. Today we are going to take a look at how to upgrade um, AVG 9 or 10, or just a fresh install of AVG 2011. And um, we'll start off by going to the, your favorite search engine. Um, I use Google, and we'll start by typing in free AVG. And the very first uh, link should come up to their website, so we'll just click on that. If you're looking at the website right in the middle, it says Free AVG Antivirus Free Edition 2011. We'll say Download Now. Go ahead and click that. Now on the next page, it's going to give us a couple of options, but we want the Antivirus Free Edition. If you look at the last link, it's that one. Now it's going to take us to a page where it wants us to download from uh, download dot, uh, CNET Downloads, which is fine. So we'll just click on that. It'll take us to this page from CNET. We'll go ahead and hit download now. Um, I have it set so you can automatically run your file. Some people might have to uh, look at the top at their bar and right click and hit download file. Um, but once you have it, you can just run it and it will automatically bring up their um, AVG 2011 installer. Now, it'll wait at this screen, please wait for a good minute. Um, I sped it up a little bit so you'll see that the time lapse is actually a, a, about a minute and a half shorter than it should be. But um, it does stay here for uh, a good minute, minute and a half. Now this is your standard license agreement. Um, this is just like any one that you've seen before, but I would recommend that you read through it. And once you have, we can go ahead and uh, accept it. But uh, just know that this is a free version, and they just say that you have to download and reinstall it once a year and things like that. Now we, they give you another option again to try to get you to uh, get the security version, but we'll just get the free. Now this, they're going to provide you with the license key so you don't have to take mine, but if you want, you're more than welcome to. This is just the one that they provided me. Um, now a custom install, I always choose because I'd like to make sure it's in the proper folder. And then at the very bottom here, there's a little um, scanner check for Office 2007, which I always make like to make sure to change and it also gives us the option to change our languages from Spanish to English and, and so forth but I always make sure that the plugin for the, the Microsoft Office is off um, just because it slows it down a bit now we do not want to have the toolbar on we will remove that and then hit next to install in this section it's going to download the actual software depending on your options um, it should be between 109 megabytes to 130 megabytes but uh, it shouldn't take you too long Now there's not too many new features between the uh, old AVG and the new one, just new uh, GUI looks and uh, things, but uh, overall it's a good solid software and you don't need to really upgrade to any of the other um, antiviruses out there unless you really had an uh, issue with AVG and you don't feel comfortable with it. Now, overall, I just wanted to say during this process, uh, it took me a total of eight and a half minutes to install from um, downloading it and actually configuring and getting it done to the complete. So, yours may take a little longer because my system is uh, quite fast. Um, but on average, I will say it takes between 10 to 15 minutes to actually install the software and get all the updates and have it running properly.
as you can see it took a couple of seconds here in this middle section of copying files and now this is probably going to be the longest section besides the very start where it was analyzing your computer um, and if you do have AVG 9 or 10 on, installed on your PC before you install this software it will remove that as well so that will take um, or add a couple of minutes to your install uh, but overall it like I said it should take you between 10 to 15 minutes to complete the full process We're almost done here. in this next section it's actually asking you for your name and stuff like that um, I actually don't want to send them statistics and you don't even have to fill in their name you just have to hit um, next and it brings us to our next section where it's going to actually update or our antivirus to the latest edition or data version and at the very bottom you can see where it says license type it does say free and it does give you your um, AVG version that you're on uh, so it's upgrading or updating now and then at the top you'll see you are not fully protected this will change to a green check mark and uh, protected in a couple of minutes right when the uh, update has completed and there you are uh, you're completely done with uh, installing your uh, antivirus if you have any questions please email me at uh, info at one two three cheap donor but uh, thank you for watching and um, take care